Hi everyone, my name is Mohsin Imam and I'm a product manager with Google Cloud Databases. I'm excited to talk to you all about how to choose a Postgres database on Google Cloud. Google Cloud aims to be the best place to run your Postgres workloads and hence provides three database services for you to choose from. I will be walking you through these three services, Cloud SQL, LOIDB, and Spanner and discussing the strengths and benefits of each service, including when to consider that service based on the criteria of your workload. I'm, I'll conclude with some information on how to get started as well. Let me start with uh, telling you a bit about the cloud databases market. The sky is the limit when it comes to reimagining digital experiences. At least that's how consumers view it. Applications are about more than delivering a service. Today's customers expect them to be lightning fast, personalized, and easy to use. Operational databases is what powers these applications and are at the heart of these fast and personalized applications. Therefore, it's no surprise that the cloud database space is evolving rapidly with the worldwide cloud database market projected to reach 69 billion by 2026. Uh, like I said, operational databases power your most important applications and therefore your businesses. Choosing an operational database could mean the difference between building a great customer experience or coming up short. Google Cloud databases are simply unmatched for speed, scale, security, and reliability. With just a few clicks and minimal overhead, organizations of any size can get started with operational databases to deliver the best possible experience for your customers from anywhere. We offer best-in-class databases for always-on applications with global reach and unlimited scale. We manage the complexity of running your databases so that they are simple to use and operate and make app development faster and easier for you. Uh, from in-memory solutions like Memory Store for Redis to relational database services like Cloud SQL Spanner, we also offer non-relational database services like Firestore and Bigtable. Google Cloud is committed to open source and open standards. We offer managed services that are fully compatible with the most popular open source engines, such as MySQL, Postgres, and Redis. And now we have LoiDB in the portfolio which brings the best of Google together with the best of Postgres. Additionally, with the availability of Postgres interface for Spanner, we can now really say that Google Cloud is the best place to run all your Postgres database workloads. Let me also address why Postgres is becoming the standard for most enterprise workloads. Postgres is a modern open source relational database originally developed at the University of California, Berkeley, and had its first release in 1996. While commonly used to manage relational data, it supports a more comprehensive set of data models. Uh, it also supports JSON document, key value, XML geospatial, and many more capabilities via its powerful extension model. This rich data model support means that Postgres is used in a wide range of database use cases. Databases created with Postgres are used in every conceivable type of application from the very simplest single user database application to demanding enterprise applications supporting tens of thousands of users running thousands of transactions a second. Furthermore, developers love Postgres. Developers choose Postgres because of its openness. Uh, developers don't like to be locked into costly licensing agreements and feeling stuck on a certain technology. Developers also love the rich functionality provided by Postgres, especially the extensible architecture and the fact that you can start small and scale with Postgres as you grow. Lastly, Postgres is a proven database technology used by millions of users and many companies and hence has a strong community of supporters and developers. So given the many options you have in deciding on where to run your Postgres database, why should you choose Google Cloud? Well, firstly, Google understands the importance of the role that open source plays in the enterprise and is committed to providing the best experience for users of Postgres. We particularly understand the importance that Postgres will play as a SQL standard layer for databases in the future. 
Google continues to offer the best experiences for developers, whether you're building out your own VM-based application or building them on top of Kubernetes. We offer modern APIs and frameworks, whether you plan to use Postgres database to build you know, modern microservices or traditional monolithic applications. Uh, and specifically, we offer three services for Postgres. Google Cloud SQL, LoyDB, and Spanner, which support Postgres workloads and provide a whole spectrum of capabilities to meet the needs of any of your workloads. Furthermore, you can choose you know, different services for different workloads without having to make compromises on each workload's unique requirements. So what this means is that you don't have to choose just one of these services to run in your environment. We have many customers running you know, all three of these services uh, you know, for their different workloads. Uh, to make a determination you know, of which of the services is best for which workload, you need to understand the specific features and capabilities of each service. There is no deterministic way to definitely say that, hey, for this workload, use this service. It's only after you understand your own business's critical needs and know what makes each service special and what that service is designed to do, will you be able to make that kind of determination. Uh, to date, you know, to help you understand how to be able to better make that determination, I will talk about each of these services in detail, specifically pointing out what kind of workload make a good fit for them. Let me start with Cloud SQL. Google Cloud's enterprise-ready, fully managed relational database service for Postgres, MySQL, and SQL Server. If you're looking for a cost-effective entry point into Google Cloud databases or for your existing databases that you need to easily migrate to a fully managed cloud service, we offer Cloud SQL with full compatibility for MySQL, Postgres, and SQL Server. It is one of the fastest growing large services in Google Cloud. With Cloud SQL, we take care of the database administration tasks to allow you time to innovate, and we do this while reducing your risk as we take care of aspects like data protection, high availability, and providing tools and processes to help you be compliant. It's already trusted by tens of thousands of enterprises globally. Uh, another advantage of Cloud SQL is that it offers easy integration with existing apps and Google Cloud services like Google Kubernetes Engine and BigQuery. So now you have a one-stop solution for all your data needs within the Google Cloud ecosystem. So why? Cloud SQL for Postgres. With Cloud SQL, what you're getting is the actual open source version of Postgres, the exact same experience that you are used to on premises or in other cloud, now in Google Cloud, supporting all major and minor versions, flags, and extensions. What you get in addition to that is, you know, you, you, you get higher availability, 99.95% um, availability SLA more granular controls over when you want to do routine maintenance. And in the case of Postgres, a very fast industry leading window for scheduled downtimes of less than 30 seconds. All this with things like cross-region replicas and point-in-time recovery make management of Postgres a breeze. Not only does Cloud SQL make managing your database easy, it also makes it much more secure and it's built on the same secure infrastructure like the rest of Google giving you access to Google's fast network and also value-added tools like integrations with Security Command Center, which helps you identify threats and misconfigurations. Lastly, with Google Cloud SQL, you get to become part of the greater Google data and application ecosystem with integrations with GKE, Cloud Run to BigQuery and Looker. We also integrate with many observability tools including our own innovative application-centric observability tooling called SQL Insights. So now that you know what Cloud SQL offers, let me help you understand how to identify workloads that would be best suited for Cloud SQL. Firstly, you know, when you're just looking for an enterprise-grade managed Postgres SQL at an attractive entry point, Cloud SQL is a tool for you. Uh, in cases where you require 
full compatibility, fully compatible Postgres database with the broadest support for you know, all major and minor releases on an ongoing basis, that's another case when you should consider Cloud SQL. And then there are cases when you're using not just Postgres, but maybe MySQL or SQL Server on Google Cloud. In those cases, it's really helpful to have a common administration interface or a common control plane. And uh, that's another use case when uh, Cloud SQL might be uh, the way to go. Finally, when you're just looking for an easy lift and shift migrations off of an existing self-managed Postgres databases, either from your own premises or other clouds, that's also the way, you know, it could be that first thing that you do, you know, the easy lift and shift migrations. Uh, definitely consider Cloud SQL for those use cases as well. Now let's talk about LOIDB, our second offering, a Postgres compatible database ready for enterprise level workloads. LOIDB is a fully managed Postgres compatible relational database for demanding transactional and analytical workloads. That's right, both transactional and analytical. That's what makes it very different. LRDB provides industry leading performance and availability, so it can handle any commercial grade workload you can throw at it. Full Postgres compatibility means regaining the freedom to run your applications when and where you want and benefiting from the entire Postgres ecosystem. With LRDB, we are bringing the best of Google innovation combined with the best of Postgres ecosystem. This results in a highly available, scalable, intelligent and performant database system. So why LOIDB for your Postgres workloads? Firstly, it's compatible with Postgres, specifically Postgres 14. This means you can easily migrate your latest workloads to LOIDB with little to no impact to your applications. The other big advantage of LOIDB is performance. It's really designed for workloads where performance is key. It's more than 4x faster than standard Postgres for transactional workloads. And for those operational analytical needs, it's 100 times faster. Essentially, the disaggregated storage and compute layer architecture provided by this database means you get predictable, very fast, cost-effective performance for your workload. With LOIDB, you also get linear read scalability, a 4 nines availability SLA, inclusive, inclusive of maintenance downtime, and non-disruptive updates for instance resizing and conflict changes. Uh, LRDB also has a lot of intelligence built in like auto vacuum, data tiering, memory management, and storage, storage tiering, apart from ML-enabled system for database tuning and automatic failure recovery. So now that you know what LRDB offers, let's, you know, let me help you understand how to identify workloads that would be best suited for LRDB. The first one is simple. Postgres compatible database workloads looking for better performance, availability, scalability, and manageability characteristics than what is available with open source Postgres. They should be considering uh, LODB. Uh, situations where reduction in Postgres administration overhead around tuning parameters, vacuuming, memory management, and storage sharing, et cetera, is required, you know, where you, know, you want to get out of all those things. That's another situation when you should consider LOIDB. Uh, you know, workloads where operational analytics is a critical need. Essentially, a mixed transactional and analytical operational database workload, that's a good fit for LOIDB. And uh, finally, situations where you're looking to modernize those proprietary databases with high license fees to a more open source compatible solution in the cloud, that's when you should start to look at LOIDB. Uh, next is Cloud Spanner, our born in the cloud database solution offering with unlimited global scale, five nines availability, and now a Postgres interface. Spanner is a fully managed relational database with global scale, asset transactions, and full SQL support. Apart from that, it offers strong consistency across regions and continents. Again, strong consistency across regions and continents 
and it is horizontally scalable for both reads and writes. Uh, Spanner offers high availability up to five nines with zero scheduled downtime and zero recovery point objective and zero recovery time objective. To give you a sense of the magnitude of its scale, Spanner processes over a billion requests, two billion requests per second at peak. There has never ever been a relational database like Spanner. So what makes Spanner a good choice for Postgres workloads? Firstly, with some of the recent innovations like granular instance sizing, committed use discounts, and the Postgres interface, Spanner is now accessible to not just the largest global enterprises, but to every company and developer, giving them the ability to start small, you know, as low as $40 per month, and then scale virtually seamlessly in the future. With Spanner, you get five nines availability, zero RPO, and zero RTO, no maintenance windows to worry about, and easy scalability and schema changes. Another advantage of Spanner is the virtually unlimited scaling of reads and writes and strong consistency at any scale. You know, if you have tried implementing such large scale databases where you require strong consistency, then you, you know how hard or next to impossible this is. Finally, you get lots of automation built in like automatic sharding, built in global replication and automatic failure recovery, just to name a few. Now that you know what Spanner offers, let me help you understand how to identify workloads that would be best suited for Spanner. First one is fairly obvious. Any workload with requirements for global scalability, highest availability requirements with zero tolerance for even limited downtime, you know, the, those kind of workloads are a good fit for Spanner. You know, workloads that require horizontal scaling of rights with you, you know, having to manage sharding yourself. If, you know, if, if that's your requirement, then again, Spanner is a good fit. All use cases where there's a business critical requirement for seamless regional and global replication, basically globally distributed workloads, they're a good fit for Spanner as well. Lastly, if you have a business critical requirement for zero RTO and RPO and strong consistency at a global scale, then Spanner is pretty much your only choice for Postgres supported workload. So now that I've explained to you what are the scenarios and criteria for choosing a Postgres SQL database, the next step is for you to really think about each of these workloads and then your workload and then map them to one of these services. Once you have done that, the next logical question is, uh, well, how, how do you get started on migrating or using these services? That's where the database migration program comes in. We know that migrations can be challenging. Therefore, we have invested in a comprehensive end-to-end -end program to help you migrate, you know, make your migration experience fast, easy, and cost-effective. Uh, we do this by providing tooling and resources for assessments, project planning, and implementation. These efforts are further amplified with incentive funding designed to reduce the cost of your migrations. It is really easy to get started. Uh, please apply the link shared here and uh, someone will get back to you with more information on how to start your assessment. To sum it up, Postgres is becoming the relational database of choice for the enterprise and for good reason. We here at uh, Google Cloud, we believe that we offer the best place to run your Postgres databases workloads. I encourage you to learn more about our database offerings at cloud.google.com slash databases. And more importantly, you can play with these services. You can start trying them out with a free trial at cloud.google.com slash free. I hope this information was helpful to you all. And uh, thank you for your time.